What's up everyone, Electronic Search here back in another video. This is this is gonna be me cleaning out this TiVo stuff. And well I mean we have a VIP down there too, so that will be included. I would include the direct TV HR21, but I don't know if the warranty is still on it. I'm pretty sure it's not. None of those direct TV boxes have warranty on Yeah, I'm pretty sure they don't, but No dude, an HR21 I mean, he most likely ran out of warranty, so. Yeah, do him. Go get him. No, I ain't. No, I'm only doing a couple of these. This is part one. It's gonna fill up my memory on this phone. Oh, 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 oh. Um, so we're gonna work on this TiVo series too, which especially for this AT&T thing, this AT&T customers. Sadly, he don't work. No, he no, uh, all of this no, is stuff. No. All this stuff is from Goodwill. No, the AT only um uh people who worked for at t got them yeah the only people that worked for at t um yeah. i have the dp plus um switch or split or whatever it is i don't understand why they can't have their cameras on the top of the ipad do you see him well what is the oh that's the cicada yeah. stuff let me move the cicadas i don't understand why I still have the cicadas and the CPU fan out here. Let me make him to the point where you can see it. You can't see it. Okay, well then that's the best I can do. So yeah, I have the switch out here. I already blew him out. Not sure why I brought him out here. I have the screwdriver bit. Uh oh, here's the model information. I'm going to make a video on all, all three of these TiVos and then separately the dish network and the direct tv direct tv boxes and then i'll include the h20 uh, h24 maybe even power him on i don't know so i have blew these out already but i'm gonna do it again again this one does not start well he starts but hard drive is either dead yeah, or yeah so all it does is just i mean otherwise the fan wouldn't spin up or wait no the fan is connected directly to the power board i think i don't know we're about to find out anyways okay four screws and that's it and we have two early launch models with one common No, the fan is connected to the motherboard. We have some styrofoam so up the here. So that stuff is dead then. I wonder why it is dead then. Yeah, you can see I didn't blow all of the dust out. There's still a CMOS in here. <laughs> the hard drive is a 40 gigabyte Western G Digital Performer. And yes, he's connected. See, the IDE is connected and the power is. It might not be connected all the way, but... No, it, it it this doesn't seem like it's ever been disconnected. Yeah. And the fan oh is connected. God, the, uh, yeah, this the, was the iMac the iMac holding my phone up. Okay, this was twelve dollars. I'm not gonna explain everything. Well twelve dollars, but I got fifty percent off. So we're gonna start by kind of blowing out his his hard drive area. Sorry for this tripod. <laughs> this isn't gonna blow all the dust out. This is gonna keep a thin layer of dust still on there, but you can see, uh, you can see some dust already start flying out. I don't understand why they designed this hard drive caddy like this. It's annoying. And especially the fan. And the other side. And now we do the bottom of the fan. See, there's some trash down there. Okay, move him to the motherboard area.
And yeah, I might as well just get a workout in for my hand. Make sure to clean up the CPUs and the CMOS battery. All right, is he called a CMOS battery? Yes. Okay. He's a Panasonic. Huh? I have COVID. I have COVID. No, I have COVID. Yeah, let me move the speakers this direction. So he's yeah, running. Yeah. TiVo SP1. He's running a TiVo SP1 REVA. -E so we'll see what the other one has. This one is working. He has lifetime service and he was only like five dollars. So this is a really good deal. Okay, now the top part. I know the, the views isn't gonna be good. Some extra dust is flying out of it though. So take care of that stuff. He's still got the TiVo logo, which I know a lot of people like to blow, or I mean, like to, like to take those off. And yeah, they like. Um, if it wasn't so hard to take those front panels off, I'd say to swap the front panels. Oh yeah, I could actually swap the panels, but I don't know how this comes hard. out. I don't see any screws. I'd rather just peel off the sticker and put it on there. Maybe it won't be sticky anymore. Well, then maybe some super glue will help. Or some residue tape or something like that. Sorry for the squeaky tripod. I'm using this drone thing because it's the only thing I have other than this big tripod, which I ain't going to be able to walk around with. Which, as you could see, every single detail. Now, yeah, obviously, there's still going to be fine dust built up on here. I'm not going to clean it out completely. And what is today's the 30th? Where's the dusty part on this motherboard? The CPU will do. I can't. Hold on, we can use these chips. Never mind, that's metal. I'm not gonna use it. Let me use this rubber. 8-30-22. Well, 8-30. I marked it on the NEC. We still have to do the ports, I forgot. Make sure that stuff doesn't fly off. It's still pretty dusty though. And also for the sticker thing on the front. Are you taking them off? No, I, no I'm putting the top back on. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with these stickers because people keep on breaking down these doors on this Dish Network and the DirecTV. So it's really hard to pick out which one to get. Because that one's rare, but he's missing the door. That one's rare, but he's missing the sticker. I mean, obviously, I can just take off the sticker from the broken one and put it on the working one and sell this one for like... 50 to a hundred dollars that's the max he can go for but I'm, I'm not gonna sell him right now i'm gonna keep him now we're gonna do the ports on the back i'll blow off the top make sure to do this phone line because he because they have the most dust in them this phone line port, just like this ethernet. Let me turn the speakers back to the camera. And we can go ahead and bolt him back up. Now this doesn't, this doesn't have to be perfect because I'm most likely gonna be able to sell this for like $15 at least if someone has a hard drive for it. No, I can take it to Goodwill or something. No, because I want to get some money from this stuff. Goodwill gives you money for it, right? No, they don't. I I traded in that vinyl player, and they didn't. T they didn't give any money. Oh, so I don't I care. It's a vinyl player. Somebody. 
How are you going to sell it? On eBay, probably. You know you're going to have to make your own account and not use mine, right? I'll also, use yours. No, you can't, because then it won't go to you. It'll go to me. What do you mean? I'll get your money. Well, I don't know. And we'll do the bottom, finally. I probably should have done that first, and then put the... Put the thing up. But whatever. And we'll do the front panel really quickly. Alright. And he's done. We'll put him on the chair. He's on the chair. Okay, what should we do next? Um, we'll do the... You know what? Let's do the common one. We'll do the common one. <coughs> so I'll take him. I'll put him right there. Now, this common series 2 really likes to break these feet off. I have a... The I, white one? Yeah, there's like two of these laying around in my house somewhere. One of them is broken. And see, there's only one more survivor left. But as you could tell by his condition, he's going to be gone soon. The other ones are all missing. Oh, and I kept the good old tag on him. As you could see, he was $3.99. Really good deal because he works and... um. He has but no service. Yeah, he doesn't have that much service. He also came with a Wi-Fi adapter, which is really cool because I can now activate So you can I can activate lifetime subscription on that TiVo right there. Right there, you can see him back there. The one that I put. And that way you can scan the channel like that way you can like create a dummy network and then use something like Anything that's AV to record off of. Yeah. So he, this one has a fan that sticks out through the back, most likely because some people just put this against the wall and, well, I mean, they can't really put it against the wall because there's these ports and stuff. I know I ignored the fan because we have to open it up. So, because we have to open it up so all the dust can just fly right out and not settle on the hard drive or the CPU. Okay, so that one had some kind of, um, what did I say before? The Rev, Rev 2, A, no, Rev, Rev A something. This one has more screws on it. Oh my god. I know the view isn't really good. Let me. There's one extra screw on here than the Series 2 early launch models. And the rare one. This one has a different hard drive than the rest of them. The other one also has a WD performer, the rare one. This one has a Maxell or a, um, what was it called, the Maxdor? Some kind of, some kind of one. It's, Maxwell, it's, Maxwell. Maxwell, yeah. This one is really hard to pull off. There's something stuck in here. I don't, I don't know what it is, but it keeps on jamming up in there. thing about COVID though? What? Since humans can spread it to dogs, I can't love all my dogs. Like, I cannot pet them. I can't do any of that. Oh, that's great. I have to yes. I have to do this, which really isn't really good. You'll also beware if you like to be around your cats a lot. If you get COVID, you have to stay away from your cat. <coughs> Where they and they will die because cats cannot recover nor can dogs. Once they get it, they're gonna die. Yeah. Okay, there. I finally got it off. 
Let me put the speaker over here. And oh no, he we both are wrong. We were both what? wrong. It has this max tour. See, this is why I need another phone. Do you see it? No. See, it's a Max Tour. Oh, yeah, I see it now. Some kind of quick view. Yeah. Max Tour, quick view, versus the Gigabyte. If you need a second phone, just use, like, as a camera or something and not a phone. <laughs> I see where it is. Okay, so go he's... Amazon. Get your parents to go on Amazon and buy something like an iPhone uh, 8 Plus for like $200 or something. Yeah. So it has a Max Tour Diamond Max 10 model 6L080LO. 80 gigabyte. And it's a quick view. Again, like I said before... Made in China. Manufactured date 2005. And some dust just flew in there. So this one's manufactured. Wait, so they were selling Series 2s in 2005 when they were selling Series 3s? That doesn't make sense. Well, I mean, that's when the hard drive was made. This could be refurbished. Yeah. This one re needs a really good dusting because I kept this guy on. Sometimes. Yeah. And especially the hard drive pins. Okay, and we'll blow out the inside of the fan. This standard definition weather local on the eighth looks really good on a 4K Vizio. D or E series 42 it's a, inch TV. It's a D series, I think. Yeah, but it's 42 inches. Okay. Well, I cleaned that up. Let's make the date 8 30. The hard drive. Oh, the CPU is a Broadcom. You might be Broadcom, yeah. Enough. You might be looking at the network chip, not, not the CPU. Well, it has the CPU type of style layout thing. Oh. The other one's a Boardcom 2. Ek, e tron Tech. <coughs> um, <coughs> Mick Ronas. <coughs> they don't got heat sinks. Not a single one. Nope. That's weird, because all every single dish network receiver. Well, except the direct, the power board. I mean, they do yeah, get every hot. single direct. Yeah, because every single direct TV box, every single dish network box, and every single TiVo unit that I've opened, which is a which is a uh, what's it called, Premiere and a Romeo. Have all had well, I mean, maybe because they're not so high quality. No, they're more high quality than the series two because they're newer and they can do better. Now, yes, I get the Romeo, the, the over the air variants are made out of plastic. <laughs> okay, somebody most likely had their TV or even worse, a CRT TV on top of this thing because. This is just ridiculous. Yeah, someone definitely had a TV or something under here. Okay, so now I don't even want to put the Lenovo on the dish hopper that I'm going to be getting. Because this type of stuff could happen too. Wait, on the dish hopper duo... See, it doesn't go in all the way. It like bends down. Oh, yeah. Someone probably dropped it. That's probably what happened. Because, um, oh, I great. This HR, HR22 kid, um, I hit him on the corner really hard and he dented, so now I have to be really careful when I try to put. Alright. So, this, this dish hopper, not the duo, because the duo is made out of all plastic, okay. but the, um, one 
have that kind of problem as well because it's also dented. Okay, so this is going to be the end of episode one because the fan decided to turn on, so I have to go turn that off. And then I'll bring the direct TV outside and we'll do the dish network in the direct TV. So thanks. Yeah, just so you know. <laughs> I'll put in the screws off, off camera. All right, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye. See you in episode two. Just so you know this.